Hey everyone, welcome to React course. In this lesson, we are going to understand what is React component. In the previous lectures, we had seen component is a heart of React. So before using React, we need to clear out concept behind the component. So what is component? You can think component as a small features that makes up a piece of a user interface. The difference component has different features. Every component have their own methods, properties and their own APIs. The reason behind the component use in the React is to provide reusability of components. Every component is independent and might interact with each component independently. Let's say you have a block. We will call this block as app. This app has a navigation menu, trending post, recent post and profile section. Each of these represent a component. So here, navigation menu is a separate component. Trending post and recent post are also separate components and as well as the profile section. Each component has their own visual representation and their logic. So each component is a piece of UI. You can build this component in isolation and put them together to build complex UI. Components are based on component-based architecture. Not to be confused with web components. It is just the most recent implementation of component-based architecture. The benefit of using component-based architecture is you can extend, replace, rescue, and encapsulate components. This architecture generally tends to be is there to rescue, maintain, and extend the monolithic UI. Now, let's see benefit of using React. Nowadays, you can see a competitor of React is Backbone and Angular. Each new generation of JavaScript framework has brought something new to the table. React isn't unique in this. What is new is React challenge some more core concept used by the most popular front-end frameworks. Following is the highlight of some React benefits. First is fast UIs. When you are working with the React application, React will provide outstanding performance thanks for the virtual dome and smart reconciliation algorithm. Second benefit of using React is easy to learn and easy to use. While we are going to learn React, you will notice React is not a complex language that takes almost a life to learn a whole concept. Everyone who comes from the JavaScript background can understand and start using React in few days. Then we have another benefit is reusable components. Each component has its own logic and controls, its own rendering and can be rescued wherever you need them. Code rescue helps makes your apps easier to develop and easier to maintain, then also help you implement a consistent look and feel across the whole project. Then we have another benefit which is JSX. This syntax is a nice and healthy blend of JavaScript and HTML. It is used specifically in React.js. This specifies a whole process of writing components for the website and the HTML aspect allow your developer to render function without concatenating strings. Don't worry, we will understand what is JSX in the future lectures. Now we have another benefit which is efficient data binding. React allow one-way data binding which exactly means that anyone can track all the changes made to any segment of the data. So this signifies the clarity and simplicity of this platform. And you can also add some additional benefit of React like this. So React makes JavaScript code easier. Then the React is extremely efficient. Excellent cross-browser support. Handle dependencies. Template designing mode easy. Provides amazing developer tools, UI focused design, and easy to adopt. Combining all these things, React is an application makes you more comfortable and save a lot of time to build a web application. Right? That's it. I hope you understand what is component and what is the benefit of using the React. In the next lecture, we will move forward. Before you take any other lesson, make sure you answer the question specified in the comment. Answering the question helps you to remember the topic more easily. That is all for now. We will see you in the next lesson.
Thank you.